back to the channel welcome back to my AJ plays and welcome back to some more PJ tour 2k23 where we are doing another course playthrough this is the collab that keeps on giving between Steve Manley and Mike Heron their new course the fighting fifth major um, look them up guys architects maze is the name they go under they have some amazing courses out there I'm assuming this one is for the major design comp uh, Mike and Steve are brilliant designers. They've come on leaps and bounds as well. Their courses are awesome. I have showcased a few, so check them out. This one, the Fighting Fifth Major, is a par 72, four pins, three tees. The longest tees being a white, playing at 7,778 yards. This being a major course, I expect it to be tricky. We're going to play from the longest tees. We're going to play from pin set three, the quintessential moving day, and we'll leave everything else as the designers intended. So let's go. Steve and Mike always do put on a good show with their courses. So let's see how this gets on. Um, this is in my society, guys, as well, which is called play underscore map underscore E underscore J. Check it out. Come in. Come and play me. I play a showcase a new course every week. I do my course playthrough and I try and beat the scores that you guys set me. Um, a new course will be up tomorrow and it will be Alan Eastwood's new design. So we will get that up tomorrow. I think it's Debbie Vale, it's called. So that'll be on tomorrow. So we got, they do like to give you some options. We're going to go around this tree. Now, what you'll notice, guys, straight off the bat is my driver is now 295. Um, I will used to have 298. Uh, sorry, 288 as my driver. But I have increased its distance and have sacrificed some swing path and timing. So let's see. This is the first time I am playing on Masters with it. So let's see. And that's a nice first drive. I'll take that. Good shot. That's a good Second shot. Thank you, John. First. So 206 yards in on this opening path. Oh, look how beautiful this is, so guys. These guys, they know how to design the course. Look at it. Just glorious. Just the detail. I love it. Anyway, I won't get too sidetracked by detail of plants. I know some people can obsess over this stuff. I can appreciate it looks pretty good. But let's get on with the golf. So yeah, a little change to my setup. I changed quite a few clubs to be fair. Um and that kicked on nice. That was a lucky kick. That's what you call a member's bounce. So we have 161 greens on the default green speed. So they're fast. Uh, this is uphill. I think it's going to be probably just outside the line. Let's give it a give it a roll and see. It was just outside the line, but I moved it at the last minute an extra millimeter, and it cost me to miss the putt. So we are going to open with a par. Long par four there, so not bad. Only got 200 yards in on a par four. You're lucky to make a birdie. Nice little television stand up there. Mick is leaving, leading away at 300 through five. And Mike himself, the designer, Ohio State Mike, he's 200 through five. Let's see if Good we can match that for three, It is his course after all. So we have a par three up next, 177 yards. Glorious looking par three. A little bit of spin on this and we should be good. It's a better strike. Still, my swing putt, see that? Perfect strike. The wind wasn't that strong. It's my swing line is hanging on the right edge well of the white box in the middle. It's been doing that for a while and it's really impacting my shots. Um, not too sure how to fix it, to be fair. I keep trying to move my controller to all sorts of positions, but then you just start doubting yourself. Let's see if we can make a putt. Mm -hmm. Again, see, it's on just on the right hand side, which is causing things to go further right than I'd expect. We're opening par par. Two tricky opening holes. Mix at three through six. Loading up for a par five here. Let's see how we get on. Again, choice of routes. I'm going to go through, hopefully, through these bunkers. I feel nice like that is there. the better angle into the green. Second shot on the third. Oh, it's a nice big stadium up here on this par five. I've got a 258 in my three wood now, as opposed to the 253 I had previously. So, as I said, change things up. 
Oh, my feet took that so far right. Wow. I have noticed on this game, I don't know. Let me know in the comments if you've noticed it. The feet seem to be massively impacting shots now, more so than they used to be. I don't know if they've changed something. Go 92. I don't know if they've changed something in the game, but my feet are definitely having way more of an impact than they used to. This should start to come back. Is it going to come back enough? Turn. No. Oh, man. Not bad. Okay, Decent effort. Three -footer. Tough greens, as you'd expect. This is designed That's for right. the major competition again, I'm assuming. Um, so these courses the are going to be tricky as hell. Because they are supposed to be for a TGC Tour major competition. And now we're teeing up on the fourth. Lovely little island green here. I love their courses. Does 158 get there, guys? <laughs> Let's tee loft it a bit. Let's see. Oh, pushing a fast might actually straighten that up. Oh, that's gone a bit long. That's gone. Did not need the D loft on that. That pushing <laughs> fast really did even each else eat itself out. So, but we've got a tricky little putt Set here back down towards the, the tee Nothing wrong with that. the pin I should say god I'm losing my mind at the minute still lots going on guys um, my partner had an op yesterday so she's just in recovery and I'm playing this but it's not too bad this time it's not as big an op as last time so hopefully it won't be as long for her to recover from so, I'm getting the golf in while I can. And we're two under foot four. I'm going to take that. So far, not struggling too much with this new driver. Oh, I'm right behind a tree. What have I done here? Oof, I'm just okay ish. 118 should be perfect from our great leader. Is that you, Mick? Are you the great leader? Did you pay John to say that, fella? You'll be all right there. It's a slow. Good luck. I can't oh, remember what clubs I've 16. changed. I changed a lot of them, guys. Changed a lot of the specs. I don't know why I'm fiddling with it now. I'll tell you why I'm fiddling with it now. I tried to play um, TGC Tours this week, and my warm-up round for it, I played in Elite and didn't get... I think I ended nine holes at par. <laughs> and, um, I played a few holes in Platinum and then quit out. I just wasn't equipped for it. I do not have the oh. requisite length of my clubs. Um, all right, and I just don't have the skill set right now, as you just saw from that putt. I don't exp I don't know how that rolled out that far. Um, it was two inches downhill, guys. It wasn't a foot fucking downhill. I don't know how I'm by here. But yeah, I um, just didn't feel like I had the requisite skill set. So I've just changed all my club fittings. Um, still playing as rhythm, but put a bit more power into my woods and my driver. Um, I changed some stuff on the irons too. Um, just to close the gaps between some of the distances. You know, I had that big 140 to 160 jump, and now 142, 157. So, took it down to 15 yards. Come on, let's, let's power this down there. Full loft. Probably be in that bunker on the left. Oh, no, that's gone way right. How has that gone over there? Again, is that that push? Yeah, I'm not sure where this is. Nice uh, I don't mind mulch. I'll take that. We're in the, in the mulch. I'll take a mulch. I should get up there and kick on. And then hopefully just calm down. That's the most accurate shot. I find with flops, again, let me know if you're finding the same. They always just go directly left off the club. No matter what you do with the club, they just go directly left. So I need to start accounting for that. How is that not taking any of the break? And here we go. This one for par. That is all moving. So I know my swing line again was off to the right, but it shouldn't have held it out there. And we are struggling. We're at two through six. Looks like Mick is loving this course this week. Super wakes in there at even. Took us there at plus five. And now we're teeing her but it's a tricky course because these are good players. No, do I clear that? <laughs> You even bother trying. I know you all the way back here if you don't. Gonna have to try. Go try and clear this, boys. Yeah, that should be good. Shouldn't it? Oh, fuck. 
<laughs> no. <laughs> How is that not... Mike, that's bad design. <laughs> Ah, uh, that that is poor from me. That's not anything to do with the design. That was just bad judgment. As I said, my game's not quite there. Look at this swing line. I don't know, but I don't know why a fast is sending it that far right. Again, is it my feet? Am I missing something? My shots have been skewing all over the place, and it didn't used to. Um, so I don't know. Maybe it is my swing line. Maybe. That's going to stay out right as well. Ooh. I don't know how Here to fix go. this. I'm going to have to try and move around. I sort of didn't want to faff with moving around, but I'm going to have to try because this is not going well. We are one under through seven. Don't think I'm going to be double digits in your course, the major course, but I haven't double digits in any of the major courses. But Mick Rogers is on the old 7 11. He is absolutely flying. Par four staring us down nice to see that one. boy win this event, to be fair. Nice Plays every week in my down. society, and I appreciate it, Mick. Thank you for the support, mate. And this one's about 135 yards to go. And I am struggling with my game right now. Real bad. Don't trust my swing. See, that's staying out right as well. Come on, come I've on. moved completely my controller position. Job, if anything, it's hanging man. off the edge of my leg now. And it's still it's about fifteen feet. Still not right. And it's impacting everything. My putt in, my approach play. Every element of my game is being impacted. Again. Uh, right that line on the right hand side is and, uh, starting to distract right. Let's stop talking about it. Let's carry on. It's not good content. I'm getting distracted by my fucking swing line over this beautiful course, right, this tough course. Under, and we are one under through eight. An absolute abysmal front nine. Got a right to left cross breeze going on this hole. Yeah, two options again down this fairway. This one you seem to be obscured by trees. This way is probably the longer path in, but let's... Oh, fuck. Will you hit all those trees? Oof. Do we clear the trees here? I don't know if you clear these trees. I, mm. This is interesting. Let's try doing this then. That was powerful. It's a beautifully shaped shot. Okay, hole number nine, shot number two. If I practiced this course, I would know if we cleared the trees, but I had not. And I did not know. I'm sure you didn't plan that one. Okay. Setting up here now for our third shot. Oh no. Let's do this. Let's do the fun and games that is the fully lofted. This could spin a little bit too far back. Stop there. Sit there. Nice. Well done. All right. Nice three footer to deal with. All right. And the front nine at two under. Uh, not the best. Five shots back of Mick. Don't think we can make that up in this back nine. Not the way we're playing, but you never know. It's not been the greatest of returns from Christmas. Um, I've started to play pro a lot more. And um, bend this round this tree. Oh, absolutely chunked it with a slow. Start to play pro a lot more. Um, Not sure what's going to happen here. Just to give me something different to do, really. Um, but it has really impacted my my master game. So I need to get back into a few more master societies. But that looks like a good shot. It's going to run off the green, isn't it? Yep. Bunker into greener pastures. We're in the fairway. You got some good distance on it. Well done. That's not going to turn. Hey, I just don't like understand that nice why that blue line won't be dead strength, right, dead center. Two under after that one. It's really stressing me out. Oh, mix drop the shot. Four shots back. Up. Come on, let's make a move. Now, where's the tee on this one? Oh, it's over there. Can you even make this fairway? These guys are absolute fuckers, isn't they? I'm gonna have to go round these trees. See if we can shape it round them to this bit of fairway. What a great course. I love courses like this when you have to shot shape. I just hate the fact that I'm not playing to the best of 
My ability. More ability. Respect my authority. Oh, that's slow and that butthole. Look at my butthole and my swing and the front of my swing and everything is just awful. Please just hold the green. It's not going to hold this green. It's going to run off to that right. It's going to go down the hill. Here we go. Go on in. Go on in. Your dirty runoffs. I don't know if that was a prerequisite of these major courses that you have to have shitty slopes all around the greens, but every course I've played has them. <laughs> to be honest, it was a big enough fairway to miss all that shit. Um, so that's pretty much on me. Did not need to be hitting all that. That's a nice out if it sits. Here we go. This one for birdie. Looking pretty good. I tried to keep that on the left hand side of my <laughs> of the swing plane. Did you see the push at the top of my swing plane? Whoa! What happened there? Were they both just at four under? How are they eight and seven now? There's got to be an eagleable one somewhere. They were, they were four. No, they were six and six, weren't they? I was four shots back. So there's an eagleable hole coming up then. It looks like they eagled it and birdied it. And that's a slow. That's going to be outright. Assuming that swing line it is. There you go. That's what you want. Setting up a 12 foot putt here. So we're going to have to change the way we swing from now. There we go. He's on a good line. <laughs> robbed. You were robbed. Robbed. You were robbed. Keep you at three under. Oh. Three under through twelve. Yeah, Don't feel like I'm doing your course justice, guys. But we're on the thirteenth. Four hundred eighty-eight yard par four. Trees in the way. Gonna have to loft this up. Let's see what happens. Oh, I've absolutely chunked it again. I am chunking a lot of shots, but somehow I've gotten away with that one. That'll do nicely. Okay, about 170 yards to the pin. Trying to sort out my swing line. It's, um, distracted me a little bit. All right, let's get a birdie and get out of here. What do you say? I'd love to, John. But at the minute, I'm not sure my game's quite at that speed. Well, it's heading towards the hole. No. I'm really... Just, uh, mm. yeah, a anyway, much look, on there. let's stop talking about all that crap. Yeah, right. Drops for par. Nice, done. Uh, well, we're at 300 through 13. <laughs> Not the way Matty J well, normally plays. Um, but it's good for you boys to see me struggling around the course, to be fair. Um, Teeing off now in a long par 4. That is a terrible swing as well. Good shot. Setting My up here from above the control lever has gone all loosey goosey. Oh my god. What is going on? The slows I can handle. It's this swing line. I don't understand why it's constantly going off to the right at the top. It's really pissing me off. It's alright though. It's only a 54 foot putt for a birdie. Yikes, that went right Stop then. It's not going to stop, is it? We're going to go in the river. Go on then. Go on. Okay, this one's 20. Down by the river. Oh my god. Oh, it could be. And it <sighs> helps. Well, that was a good recovery par, but that swing line stressed me out again. Mm. I've been totally consumed and distracted, so apologies. It's starting to yeah, really cheese me off, and I'm cheesing myself right off. But the course is great, and it is tough. Mick ended up at six. Mikey Boy got to his nine under, which you'd expect. He designed the course. He knows its nuances. Um, I should be a lot better than I am, but I'm playing like I've just picked up golf clubs for the first time. And maybe I have, given it's a completely new set. The first time I've played with them. 
Um, probably wasn't the best idea. Oh, no. Well, let's go for it. Shit, I'll burst now. Please clear it. Please clear it. And kick up somehow. And kick left somehow. All right. Good shot. Let's just find golf playing there. That's uh, on the green in under regulation. Well done. This one's for Eagle. Please North's turn. Getting there. Yes. Yeah, that drops and we're heading down the final Finally, something. Something to be happy about. <sighs> Don't feel in control, but I'll take an Eagle there, guys. As always, if you're enjoying the content, please do like and subscribe. Surely that eagle's worth a like. Um, my golf, maybe not so much. So, take it back. Are you hitting this tree? Let's find out. That's a better shot. If it sits. Mm, too much club. I thought it might be too much club, but I didn't want to risk going less club. We've got a 17-foot putt on this one. Oh, is that right inside again? But it putt should be okay. Yeah, I'll we'll take that. So, so I'll take that. Oh, six under. Can't catch old Mikey Heron now. Six under at the but we're making it slightly more. I mean, it's not really, is it? Let's be fair. But we're second. Woo! Caught up with Mickey boy. Taking a Mickey, really. I should not have caught him up. Not the way I'm playing. Oh my god. I can feel myself slowing stuff as well. That's the problem. I can feel my bunk swings. It's like my thumb and finger aren't listening to my brain hole. You're just three strokes off the lead. Let's adjust for these feet. <laughs> I tried to keep my swing line on the left there, guys. What do you think I tried to do? Keep my swing line on the left. Did you see my swing line? Okay, now, like a kid picked up a crayon and squiggled everywhere. Should run left. Turn. Tough little course. Beautiful course. Fighting fifth major. Get out there and play it, guys, by Architect Maze. Mike and Steve, I appreciate your work. Sorry, I couldn't do it justice, and I pretty much moaned the whole way through. <laughs> it is a lovely course, guys, as always with you boys. You know that. Um, but yeah, I'm just struggling. Time to go back and rethink. I'll stick with these clubs for now that I've set up. See if I can get used to them. I think it's more my my actual finger and thumb that's the issue. Maybe it's an age thing. Might need some more club. Maybe I'm just too old for this shit. That was a better... Look, even that's gone right, though. I thought that was a better strike, but somehow it went that far right. I mean, right that is like there. five yards right at a target with a perfect swing and a line that was pretty much on the white line. So, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's all in my head. Maybe I'm imagining it. Oh. Right by. And this next pot four. Well, maybe I won't be tied second. Maybe I'll throw it away. Okay. No, we get in. We drop for a woeful, a woeful, pitiful six under at the fighting fifth major. We didn't fight. We got knocked out on pin one and didn't really recover, to be fair. We couldn't find our legs. And we were done. That is a TKO for the architect me I will give him that six under time to do some more work catch you all soon